Hey guys, welcome to the channel. All right, what do you guys think? You guys think it's time to trade up? GT500. 2021 with the um, track package that means with the full wing uh, carbon wheels for carbon fiber wheels let's see what Joe let's see what Joe Myers is asking for this ride boy she's gorgeous I hadn't seen one in person yet she is beautiful Man, check out those wheels, dude. They're really popping in the sun. I'm assuming this is a sold order, somebody's order. We'll find out right now. It'll probably have somebody's name. But this blue is gorgeous. Some of you guys think, you guys think I should trade in the uh, scat pack? With this bad boy? I'm thinking this is about 119, maybe 120. What do you guys think? Before I put it, can you guys guess? way off it's about 96 it's a lot of car for the value See if that captures the, uh, the window sticker so that carbon fiber track package is 18.5 just by itself I don't believe these are the painted stripes that's like 10,000 this seems to be the $1,000 option which is basically their um, they're put on there they're not painted on there which they still look badass i think ten thousand dollars for stripes is just a waste of money got the recaro seats in there boy she's nice look at those exhausts i mean i can literally I'm not even joking. Like you can fit your my whole fist in there, guys. Like that's incredible. Sheesh. Boy, she's beautiful. Let me go wide stance here. Beautiful, man. Love the color. There's that Cobra logo. Six piston. Running on some Sport Cup 2s. Straight up race car track wheels. I mean, this this right here, like my old ZL1 1LE had with cups on it. I mean, you'll pick up every rock. So, I mean, you have to get some 4S Michelins for sure for this ride to make it, you know, street. Unless you, you plan on getting her taking her for the track all the time that might be it but man these these tires would have to be changed i don't see a name this is a very rare car to get guys by the way because of the the track pack it's very difficult to find these on lots i'm assuming you know that's the price but there's probably going to be a markup of maybe 10 15 000, who knows uh for this car going through a full remodel okay so since I'm here I hadn't seen one of these in person let me see what the what the hype on the Broncos about I hadn't seen one so far guys it looks really nice super like almost like the 90 if you guys are an 80s kid there was a uh, these Tonka trucks that were coming out in the 80s in yellow reminds me of a little Tonka trunk it really does I'm assuming this is a sold order. Beautiful color. It's called the Wild Track. They have different type of packages. It's 
V-block wheels, I think. That's what they call them. With the rag top. With the full spare in the back. It's nice. Big, beefy tires. You got uh, almost like the scat pack with some flares on the side. A little wide body, huh? A little wide body action. Not sure if this is a sole order. Typically, like you guys know, if you ever ordered like a Dodge vehicle, they'll put your name on it. I didn't see it on the GT500, and I'm also not seeing it here. This car is being stickered for $57,000, guys. $57 for this. Wow, that's that's pricey. $57. Wow. All right. It's a little, a little hot here in H-Town right now. Let me go this way. Oh man, look at my ride. She looks nice under, under the, uh, with the green. With these trees here, the car just kind of blends in. Look at that, man. Yes, sir. Yeah, buddy. What do you guys think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time, time to trade up. Look what I found here, guys. A Camaro SS with a 1LE package. They started making these with the automatic, believe it or not. It's just a good looking car. They started making it with the automatic for 2021. I think it's a one year, one year stint that Camaro's doing. You know, the Camaro's not the best looking car anymore, but when you get them with the 1LEs, both on the ZL1 and the SS, I think the car looks amazing. And then what's funny is right behind it, we have a Scat, I mean a Hellcat. It looks like a 2016. We'll find out right now. We'll look at the sticker. Beautiful, non-wide body. It's a new set of tires. I actually think the Camaro looks a little bit better with those wide hips. This looks way better when you get it with the wide body. You gotta get it with the wide body. That's the only way, man. Let's see what they're asking for here. Let's see if they have the price on it. Actually, I was wrong. It's a 2015. Has about 31,000 miles on it. Uh, doesn't say the price, but uh, you guys see where I'm at. Check these guys out. I'm assuming it's hard to tell from the 2018 to the 2021s because what year is this one? This is a 2020, but it actually has a six speed. It's a six speed automatic trans, I mean, six speed manual. You can get it with the 10 speed automatic. All right. All right, towards the back, it looks like they have a Z06 Corvette over here. It's hard to tell, but again, it's gonna be, it has a full ceramic. You can tell it has a track pack on it. I think this is, might be sold already. She's, she's gorgeous. Yeah, it's a sold unit. You guys can tell right there. She's beautiful though. Full ceramic brakes. You can tell it has a track pack just by the big wing and the side skirts. You could also tell by the down over here, this down, this chin spoiler down at the bottom. You know, these cars have actually gone up in value, especially with this uh, chip shortage now, so. They've gone up in value more than what they used to be at. 